Here we go. Now, it's time to find out to my theory. Hey, are we there yet? About this upcoming boss. Bye. But because I heard the Neptune talk? Hey, are we there yet? Shut up! Just a little farther! Hmm. Hmm. Huh, it's rare for me to catch you thinking about anything. What's wrong? Um, well, were there always this many monsters here? Oh, good point. Their numbers have been increasing ever since you became a CPU, actually. But if this many monsters are around, we can't have a picnic. It'll be fine with us three. I mean, when I come here, I can take care of myself just fine. But if we run all over and get into fights, the picnic basket will get smushed. So, are we there now? How about now? No? You're both way too noisy! I said it's a bit farther, didn't I? Look, you can see it from here! Oh, that's the ticket! Right. I'm gonna engage my NAS! I gotta get it before Noir! Hey, stop! Mmm, clever girl! That wasn't clever, it was cheap! Hey, I'm Earth! Stop right there! Eat my rubber. What kind of idiot would just wait because they were told to? Whoa, he break. Ah! Owie, I'm not a bumper car, you know. I get bruises. You're the one who shouted some nonsense and stopped all of a sudden? Oh, what is with you? I had my reasons. Look, some people are over there. People? Why would anyone else bother coming out here? I'm amazed we found two of these items. Such a thing is unprecedented, isn't it? That's for sure. Maybe because the wrinkly god chick did a rare thing. This is our just reward. Brett, if you value your tiny life, you'll stop calling me that. I only speak the truth. Wrinkly? Check. Stop makeup? Check. You should stop calling me Rat. I have an adorable name, and that is Pirachu! <laughs> Don't make me laugh. There's nothing wrong with calling a rat a rat. That wicked smirk. The only one who can tolerate such a thing is the rodent world idol, me! Is this a washed up comedy duo? Huh. I feel like I've seen that goofy rat thing before. You know that thing? I think so. My memory is kind of like black, whatever. I get the same brain tingle from that old lady, too. Like something I lost on an old hard drive. So what are you saying exactly? Wait, they're holding up. Oh, no, 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 that can't be. Why so serious? They have the CPU memory! Huh? That thing in the mob? I don't know what's happening. 
happening right now, but it sounds like you're also after this. I'll only say it once more. Hand over the device now! Whoa, you are just totally made a cliche villain comment. This is my cue to jump in, too. Yeah, do what she says, scumbags, because that's my thingy. Gimme! If you don't... What a noisy bunch of brats. Wait, you. Are you Neptune? Huh? How in the heck do you know my name, lady? Wait, maybe I've become super famous here, too. No, I've never met you. I knew with a single glance that you are the one person I hate the most in all of game industry. Uh, okay. I really think you should taper off this crazed fan thing. Rat, take this and go. I'll eliminate these twerps. Huh? You cool with that? You think you can take us all on? You should think of this as an honor. You will be sent to your graves by none other than R4, one of the seven sages. What did you say? Seven sages. She was all like, blah, blah, blah. Seven sages. Whoa! Why are you giving them your big intro speech? Who cares? These children will be dead very, very soon. Uh, I think that cockiness just triggered your defeat flag. Whatever, I guess. This wrinkly goth chick's fate is no concern of mine. Wait! You leave that right here! Stop! You're not going anywhere. I just said we're going to fight, didn't I? Don't worry. I'll kill you just as painfully as I will Neptune. You're lumping us together? I won't go down as easily as she probably will. Playing second oboe is still serious business. I mean, now I suddenly have a sworn nemesis. How long are you going to prattle on? It's not my style to kill swiftly. Show me your desperate, pathetic struggle to survive. What is up with this crazy old bag? Is she going to turn into a dragon or something? No! <laughs> My final gift to you. Don't turn into a rabbit. Burn my image into your eyes! We have to go all out of Mohawk and Knockdown! I've been waiting for this! If you can tell by Cybertonette being in the starting party, Lutea's not with us. And, uh, let's act like we even have a chance, shall we? You won't escape from me. Ready? Nice! Fearless Wild Blade! Cut you, cut you, cut you some more! So sweet! Still don't have anything. Let's try, um, Bright Attack. I think maybe. It's my turn. And the noir slice away. Ready? 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 Seriously, you're not a 
that's Boots the Beater! at the moment to actually beat her. It's cool if she flips out by herself, but I'd rather not get dragged into it. Please wait for me, Mr. Rat! Hold up! I finally caught up. Nonsense. What does that mean? Are you saying 
something bad happen to my friends? I didn't do it. Just think of it like this. They ran out of luck today. You know, if something happened to them, I might get angry. You are always stops me. But... This psycho is talking to herself now. I have my limits, you know. I ain't gonna smack a dime piece. But maybe a little discipline wouldn't hurt. It's okay to get mad at times like this, right? I need to get back to them. Fine. I'm gonna do it. Yikes! That's some bright shit! <laughs> such big balls and such a tiny weight. They're showing me so much arrogance. But who are you? Wh where'd that airhead go? Rats are disgusting little ball feeders whose only skin is wallowing in others. Did she transform? No way! She, she can't be the CPU, can she? <laughs> the CPU? Who gave you permission to address me as a pure wood? Holy crap, dude! This is bad! My rat senses are screaming at me to run the hell away! But, but my body is totally paralyzed and I'm screwed! You will call me Madam Goddess, scum! <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, are we gonna lose? Man, she seriously didn't look this strong. Is it okay for the protagonist to lose so soon? So weak that it annoys me. Why did I get worked up over these worthless girls? Are you asking us or something? I don't know. You're the one who flipped out and transformed. Silence! That noise you make frustrates me even further. as you lived. All over? No. If only I were a CPU, this wouldn't have happened. This sucks. If I could go HDD on her butt, we'd be fine. But I'm gonna get a game over. Maybe I made a wrong choice. I hope I can load from the last checkpoint or whatever. Say goodbye. No! Oh, man! Barry! Hmm? Who dares to get in my way? Wow. This is so pitiful. Yet somehow, marvelous. Adorable young ladies getting laid out by an ugly tramp is a rare sight. Who the hell are you? I'd like her. Snappy Snap! Another villain! Wait, is she a dominatrix? An angry goth geezer one way, a dark dominatrix the other. Poor screwed. Bye bye, life. Why did you transform, Claudia? Oh, yeah. I forgot about her. Where'd she go? Did she run away without us? That's cool. I don't hate her for that. Live happily for me, my darling. Huh? Transformed? Wait, that means no. -uh. What? That? That person is Flutie? Oh, why? You moved me. I went and transformed so I could save that ass of yours. Poor little Noir. You have such high hopes and such a little strength to crush your obstacles. Didn't have to go that far. <clears throat> How cute, with tears in your eyes and that hurt expression. I think you just became an adult. No, don't make that face anymore. If you keep it up, I doubt I can control my urge to torment you. Or maybe that's what you want. Is that your please punish me face? I don't have a face like that! Crap, this was the last thing I wanted to happen! I told her not to transform so many times! 
this is HTV Flutie? The spaced out gullible Flutie? Sadie suits this form better. I don't believe it. I mean, my voice changes and everyone else gets tougher. But she's way over the top. The longer this scene drags on, the less I get what's happening. <laughs> Are you Planetune CPU? Hello, I am CPU Iris Heart. Ruler of Planetune. Even an idiot like you caught on, huh? That's quite a mouth you have. Also, that thing you're dragging behind you. Is it your rat friend? Yes. I see. You can hold your own against a rat. However, if you think such a minor victory will make me flinch, you will regret underestimating me. Like a bitch in heat. Control your more primal urges, you dog. You showed me a lovely sight. So I'll reward you for letting me witness their pained faces. But before that, here you two. Quite frankly, I love... Iris Heart! <laughs> oh! The CPU Memory Gizmo! <laughs> Stole it back by force. It seems that even CPUs can act like barbarians. How rude! It is the payment I was owed for the services I performed on dear Mr. Rat. The three of us need to have an important power. So would you shut up for a few lines? You two want these, right? Of course, you know that! Me, me, me! I want one, yeah! Yes. So you want, yeah. If you want something, there's a certain attitude you must adopt to get it. If you want me to give these to you, I'm hoping you will do something for me. Damn! What? What? Whatever could it be, Sadie? Uh oh. Do you want my sexy bod? No! But I guess if it's you, maybe if you're difficult. <laughs> Your body, hmm? <laughs> oh, that's not half bad, little Neptune. <laughs> My spine just froze. Uh, maybe I spoke a bit too soon. So, Pluty, actually, you wouldn't dare to retract your delectable offer now, would you? Uh, um, well, if that's how things gotta go, um, I just gotta have to try to be nice and gentle, okay? Oh, my second touch will be anything but painful. Let's save your body for later. Right now, my body aches for you, Mom. How will you talk with our Neptune's offer? You're not the type to accept sloppy seconds, so surely you'll have something better for me. What's better than my body? What more is there to offer? <clears throat> you set up a stupidly high hurdle for me to jump, Neptune! <laughs> Shame on me. I know. I didn't think she'd take me seriously. Oh, what's she gonna do to me? I see. Noir doesn't really want this after all. I'm so, so sad. But it isn't like I need another one. I suppose I'll just throw it away. You no! Know, you're kidding, right? If you're just gonna throw it away, give it to me instead! But I thought you'd be happy to give yourself to me. I thought you really wanted this. I wonder how long it would take for you to find another one, all by yourself. <laughs> Noir, punch up your pride like foreign undies and toss it away. It's not that hard, is it? Even if you get broke a bit or get into some kinky stuff, you'll end up able to transform. Those options are the worst things I've ever heard. How about you shut up? You do have a point. If I discard this and someone boring finds it, that way
would be a pain. It's best to destroy it. I'll smash it on the ground and grind it to dust under my heel. Wait! Okay, just, just wait! Oh? Did I hear something that isn't what I asked to hear? <gasps> Fine! You can ask me. What? I can't hear your pathetic whimper. I'll do any one thing you ask of me. So, please! <laughs> Beautiful. What an absolutely tempting proposal. Oh, that's extreme, Noir. You have both done so well today. Here is your reward for keeping me entertained. Thanks! Well, I mean, my head is nothing around some pretty complex emotions right now, but... At last! Finally, I can... I'm sorry to all the four of you. You're such a good villain to wait for us in silence. I just didn't want to get involved in that incredibly demeaning farce. Besides, aren't those two your friends? Are you sure you want them to go through with this? They are mine, yes. What's the problem? Those with the ability to become CPUs are one in a thousand. No, one in a million. And yet, you must know what will happen if someone lacking the ability tries to use one of those. Um, they would take on a most hideous form, correct? If that happens, oh well. CPU of Planetune, you are a cold, unfeeling woman. Don't misunderstand. Whether they're these cute little ladies or hideous monsters, I will play with them just the same. If, if I don't have what it takes to become a CPU, if I turn into a monster... Okay, whatever. Neptune's gonna go first. Huh? Well, wait a second! Are you having any second thoughts or misgivings? Watch me turn into a really cool chick noir. I said to wait! I'm going to become a CPU before you! What? Huh? You're yeah, the Impossible! <laughs> As expected of my little darlings. <sighs> it's been too long since I've taken on this form. No, it feels different here. I did it! I've become a CPU! <laughs> of course I did! There's no way I wouldn't... Man, this is the best feeling! Hmm, Noir seems to act differently than I recall. Hmm, you are both lovely. Is this even statistically possible? Why bother with statistics when reality already gave you its answer? Now then, you took us to the cleaners before, but now it's time for our payback! <laughs> How unfortunate for you, having to take on all three of us. Your body just might break. Don't act so confident. CPUs are not. You're just... Rather, this is preferable. Instead of wasting my time, I get to bury you all right here. Such a tired trip. Ah, I did forget to say my own vision. What? Stop muttering to yourself. I hardly expect you to beg for mercy now. Of course we won't. You took it upon yourself to torture these two, which pisses me off. So, don't you dare think I will show you any leads. <laughs> Teach me his sex! After becoming CPUs! EXE DRIVE! Gaze and unlock and utilize EX finish. Which quite frankly means very powerful. 
moves. Depending on the XC Prime, Prime gazes level in a decimal attack. The XD missile can be used. Yet, Venus or Access is determined by the gauge's level. If the EXC drive gauge is at or over a set level, the EXC or selection menu will display at the end of a character's combo. Also, when a character is assigned a partner in the back row, and their lily rank is above a certain level, they can join in in an EX. Then it's with their partner. This is called an assist. The EXE drive dates will increase as you gain or receive damage to charge of the they quickly focus on rush attacks. And as the game progresses, your EXE drive limit will increase. At first, I'm totally serious your drive limit is one. Show off cross com. Let's show off cross combination and then work on fixing this skin. Cross combination. And, uh, that is much weaker than normal, mind you. And uh, just that when I recall Plutia, you level up. Same with you, Broccoli. Falcon, Cyber Connect 2, Marvel, thank you, all Mages, Tekken. Ha ha ha, an easy win, amazing. Is this the power of ACPU? And the uh, note won't have to talk of what they're saying. Climax already? It was easier than she looked. If you haven't tasted enough of our menu, I can always feed you some one-on-one -on -one service. Oh, that's so lame. She sounded like she took that out of my bill anymore. No one book. I don't care. I'm not too dumb on my heart. Even fun at all. And then interrogations are as boring. Or boring as things. If you say so! But I'm surprised, the Pluty. I never thought your HDD form would be quite like this. And what I tell is this. 
from the words of those pretty purse lips of yours. When I change that, who does they think? They don't know. I'm not trying to punish this for Don't noir if Lutie Hunt and transformed and come to our aid. We want them to be alive now. Thank you, you saved us. Oh, don't mention it after all. After all? Mm, I do so adore a small, deadly, cheap nifty, but this new form is quite delectable, too. Oh, uh, I can't decide which of your two bodily forms to take. Huh? Um, that deal, that was just... Ludia, that's going too far! But Noir, you said you would do any one thing I asked, right? Hmm, I wonder what kind of demand I should make. So many ideas, but I can only choose one. I won't have to at this point, I'm no. I'm recording! <laughs> so, uh, you have to be quiet during an LP. That's not something I can do. Because it won't be an LP if I'm quiet. Huh? What are you talking about? I said that in the heat of the moment. Don't tell me. You better not ask me whether or not I'm going to take what you said seriously. I am. Ugh. In any event, it's uncool to sit here like this. Let's go back to the Basilicon. Prepare yourselves, the both of you. <laughs> what are we going to do, Neptune? If we break our promises, something even worse will happen. Let's mentally prepare ourselves. Teach me, Hitsy! In addition to EX finishers. You already told us about that. Quite a brindly EXE drive attacks. Pretty much are more powerful attacks. Let's go to the guild report that except that can't report any of those. And equipment, Neptune. Return to default. Because I actually prefer the default look. Let's 
Sleeps with Um Let's actually see Lost the Purple. This is the Lost the Purple. This is HDD Metal. I kind of prefer lots of the purple for the head and going for day clothes for everything else. Nope. Don't have anything for the wall. Don't have anything for saving. Don't uh, forget to get fluffy back. are the exe finishes, which I'm not sure if I'll ever bring them out for Nature. For Plutia, might. Not to being a Plutia attack is better. And that that being naughty is better. Mm. All the same. And even if it may not seem like it, you don't have to have HDD to use any X finish. And everyone is at level 7. Now, time 
to go to a cutscene. Are you ready, Nappy? Or is it really time? Will I be whisked away? Will Blue D treat me right? And it's a shot. Here I come, old Nappy. Your skin. Let's speed the room this. Because, yeah, I'm gonna show it all, but I'm not gonna show much of it. Regardless of the case. Because... Why do frankly, I don't see my channel being a channel where those scenes will be what it'll be known for. That was a blast, it's pretty neat. I'll instead read the scene. Where are you? Here I come, old nappy! Your skin looks like you've never worked a day in your life! Don't make such judgment based on one look, it out. It's embarrassing. Be nice. I'll caress you gently, I promise. Wow, your skin's so smooth. Suds in my buds. You're like a professional, Blutie. Get in there, good, and I'll pledge my sword to you. Wee! Why are you saying all this weird to be movie romance? Crap. Huh? Did I say something weird? I don't butt in m on my romantic speech. I promised this, so I got to make it sound convincing. Who are you convincing? Gee, sitting and listening to you is the most embarrassing thing ever. Embarrassing, huh? Just what scenario? Were you imagining us having to my lady? But what? I don't even. Uh, why not tell your goofy but somewhat approachable uncle about it? Come on, kiddo. Ugh, you're the most annoying person I've ever met. If you don't knock it off, I'll slap you. Ouch, hey! Noir, you're getting worked up and scrubbing too hard. What? Oh, sorry. That's no good. You better do it properly since you promised to make my body sparkly clean. Yeah, I apologize, didn't I? But I suppose I should be happy this was all you asked of us. Ain't that the truth? Blutie's eyes were like a hungry hawk or whatever back there. I really get the thought she was going to, to get all up under my duds and stuff. <coughs> There's no way I do that. Okay, Nappy, time to show me the way. Lift him up. Huh? Oh, okay. Whee! Yeah, time to scrub those sensitive little armpits. Ha 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 ha, that tickles. Hey, stop squirming and kicking. This is a bath. Come the hell down. Ha ha ha. Now let 
Now my sides are dying good, Blutie. Let's team up and scrub a noir down, okay? Oh, that sounds fun. Face of that way, Noir. Um, no thanks, I'm fine. If I turn my back to you, to who knows what'll happen to me. Oh, come on, don't be a sorry little dingo. Okay, Pluty, you fly in from the right. Ready, attack. Bubble Splash. Stop it! You little opportunist! Ah, Neptune! What did you just grab? Ah, uh, precise, dear customer. Relax. It's part of our part of service. We make you sparkle, sparkle. Yes! Stop all of this! No! I will never admit this happened. That was a blast. It's pretty neat to teach the group app, I guess. Of course it is. Let's do it again. <coughs> we'll stop reading and talking for a bit. My voice is better. Yes, it is. Summary of what's going on is after that group of that Neptune, I mean, Mini Histy was able to contact Histy, the Hist War from Neptune's dimension. That's about where we are. No matter what lens you look at it through, Neptune is totally the younger sister. Um, this is really tough, my really touching reunion thing, so don't butt in. We get that a lot, though. Well, let's plug that leaky eye plumbing. I'm fine, and I'll be home real soon. Hey!
Excuse me, Nephew Dealer. I hate to interrupt you, but same, how come only Nephew gets to have the so much fun? Neptune! So she's actually in another dimension? Let to me see too! Yeah, but to me first! Me, me, me! Oh, everyone, um, uh, do not crowd on me all at once, Ruth! Hey, Neptune, can you see me? Another dimension! Woo! It looks kinda weird, huh? Wait, is that my big sister Noir's over there too? Go go away everyone, I'm still talking to Neptune. Bring us back a really expensive souvenir like a bucket of candy. Maybe a picture book. Everyone, enough is enough! <laughs> the next in there, Mini Histi, you better not pour a four on us! I managed to get them into a different room. My heart jumped and skipped a hop. Matthew and her friends were interfering. Oh yeah, that's kind of important. How do we do it? About that, I am unsure at this time. Dun dun dun! Are you being exaggeristy? I just made dramatic noise, so you better not to be joking. There is nothing to be done! I only recently learned you arrived in another dimension. But it's your jobby job to do something about it, right? It's fully been a beauty. It's not breaking the rules. Deus Ex Machina, baby! I will research, then contact you once I find a solution. Oh, he ended the call. I figured, the one time I need her, she makes up an excuse and hangs up on my face. Even though you are upset at the other time, other me, I feel like I am getting yelled at. Isn't it enough though, to know that you and the... Uh, and they are... all okay? <laughs> Thank you.
A large spear maiden the war came out to prove the truth. Looty dog plan. Why to bring to leave? I'll be doing some amount of quests off screen every so often from this point on. Or so it seems. Remember, I'm thinking backwards vision when I look. What do you say, again? Come on, Bloody, don't muck up the first episode. Can someone get the cue cards ready? Here they are. Bloody, please read along. Oh, keys. Thanks. Thank you, Assistant Director Histy, who we call Astity for short. Please do not force such nicknames onto me. Why do I have to do this in the first place? Um, uh, this program is to tell players how good they did between cheap actors and rate them. Four highly skilled reviewers of our choice will rate the player's performance on a 10 point scale. The best of score is 40, which I'll never get. Ratings uh, that to max out at 40 seem pretty lazy to me. Anyway, if you do well, you'll get good stuff. It's a chore to get a good score. But I will be dedicating every now and then a whole episode to grinding against foes. Doing quests just to get a good score. There is no review at this time. Huh? The review start the next time. We had a meeting about this. I was quite clear. Oh, we did? Really? We've already made a mess. The script uh, called for us to introduce uh, the program and end it. What should we do now? Alright, so that's it, folks. From now on, the Silicon's TVs will let you get to the news, shopping, and other stuff. Don't miss out on any of it.
policy completely ignored her mistake and pushed on. That's it for today. The program was brought to you by me, Neptune. By Neptune, that's me. And Blue up bye bye for now. Oh, one more thing. The us on this program have nothing to do with us from the main game. Got it? Um, hello, it's been about three years since Nappy came to my dimension. Noir made her own mason and is trying really hard to make it super cool. But uh, because of her, Lowey's hairs have dropped and the two nations have blood, have the bad blood, not blood. Odd. Not Vlad. Odd. Not Vlad. Duh. Bad blood. But of course, my Neptune is as perfect as always. That that's my last cue card. Does it um, does that mean I said everything? Did I do good in Epi? Hmm. Maybe you're not really the energetic reporting type. Oh, I thought I could do it. And with that, let's play on! Lowey's a bazillion. Pardon me, Lady Blanc, but I have compiled my report. Oh, nice work. If I may summarize my findings, it would seem Last Station is in a state of exponential growth. The gravity of their influence is great enough to drag birds from the sky, so to speak. They're that influential? Indeed. Those outside of Louis with no interest in the other CPUs or games are migrating there. If it were just a mass exodus of brand disloyal non louis that wouldn't be an issue. But... Still need the business window. Uh, um, yes. Well, a lot of Louis have chosen to move to Last Station too. It seems our policy of allowing anyone to leave when they see fit wasn't quite thought through. Whatever. People have been whining about only being able to play our games while here. Until quite recently, Louis was the only CPU-led nation on this continent. We were their sole source of entertainment. Did they repay us with betrayal? Blasphemers! Do you not intend to take action, Lady Blonde? I wish you would show some sign of concern. Should this trend continue, we will lose Louis' superior position forever. Minister. Yes, Lady Blonde. No matter your command, I shall obey without question. Shut the hell up. You speak like a salesman. My pardons, but if you just review the report I compiled, you will understand my worries. With that said, excuse me. Not like I'm sitting around doing nothing. I know what I need to do. Meanwhile, at Play Neptune's Basilicon. <laughs> Oh, 
Lugia, I'm actually sleepy as well. Which is part of the reason why I haven't got around to being to actually uploading much. Or even recording. Isn't it though? Let's take a real long nap. Instant sleep coma activate! <laughs> In game man this three are you two sleep oh yeah game man this three are you two sleeping right now I'm alarm oh 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 jeez Histy That's so cool Histy making just such a loud noises when we're sleeping peacefully I made a loud noise. Two CPUs just sitting around indoors doing nothing. You simply must begin to tackle your workloads. So you say, but to look outside, the weather's too nice to do anything. Napping is the best choice. Engage instant sleep coma! Do not fall asleep in the late middle of my lecture. Not. Do not fall asleep in the little of my lecture. The two of you should learn from Noir. Noir, I guess we haven't seen her for a while. She's too busy working, she made her nice and you know, um, what's it called, blast or something, it sounded like lactase, lactation, oh, last rebellion, lactation, oh, yes, that's the ticket. You are such a workaholic. She can't make any friends because she loves work too much. I agree, not having friends would make Flutie a sad panda. Well, that is true, but I do not think that gives you carte blanche to do nothing. Anyway, she hasn't given me a ringling for years. If we try to call her, it won't connect. Well, connecting to a different dimension is a bit more difficult than a long distance call. Even at maximum processing output, it will take me three days to establish a connection. What do you want me to do about it, Mini Hasty? 
and the big hits be all to blame. It's a double hits be fail. But may be possible, my god. But that does not mean you may nap all day. Oh, but if many his desserts and can't read to my better his tea, it's hard for me to do my best. Uh oh, Nappies is vibrating with rage. It's just annoying that many his tea is a donkey old model and so so bad. In my world, a mini history would be less of something a graphing calculator. You bit! Won't the censor yourself? Rah! Who in blazes is the less fun signal than a calculator? Say that again! Deep fried HD in my gables. History is beyond the piss. You dug your own grave. By finding her biggest thing security, her low processing power. Really, did I accidentally grind her teeny tiny gear? You are merely passing the blame on to me. So that you can be lazy, are you not? And the fluky, I do not act like none of this applies to you. You are slacking off too. Whoa, 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 don't pop your top, Pisty. This made me imagine her head. That made me imagine her head blowing off like a rocket. Uh oh, that's one angry emote. Characters are designed to be cute, so I'm going to make that face. Facial expressions are not your concern right now. Get over to last space and now! Woo! Outside landed on my boxes. Which is your butt bone, if I recall correctly. I've never seen Hissy get that mad before. That be you're like an angry Hissy making prodigy. And uh, now we actually drive the level two. Okay, I'm done shopping, so I think we'll skip on home and get to work on a new costume design. And I uh, hear say DLC character scene. Huh? Marvy? 
I wonder why she looks so worried. As someone who can always hide her emotions, I'm concerned. I'll follow her. Uh, what should I do? Marvy Poo! Ah! Lady Noir! I almost peed! Sorry, I scared you good, huh? I noticed you sighing. What's up? I guess I'll listen if you want to talk about it. Actually, my uniform got all ripped up. I didn't bring any spares, so it feels like such a waste. Aww, what will I do? Oh, so that's what this is about. <coughs> I'm not a pro like Tootie but I know my way around a needle. I'll catch up your outfit for you. You will? Who do you think you're talking to? I am the CPU of Last Station, Blackheart. With my power as a CPU, I can repair one or two rips, no problem. What do you say to this? Wowee! It's like new! CPUs can do anything, huh? Even if it's me, I wouldn't say CPUs can do anything. It's just that I've been into cosplay. Uh, I like making my own clothes, so I use leftover fabric to fix yours. You are so amazing, Lady Noir! I should thank you properly somehow. I fixed your clothes because I like sewing, that's all. You don't need to do anything special in return. But I can't do nothing! As a Lady Ninja, I am honor-bound to return a favor. Is that so? Ninjas have it rough. Well, I mean, if you have to, then I might have a favor to ask. Sure, ask me anything. Even if it's just occasionally, could you try on the outfits I make? And, uh, if you're fine with it, could we maybe go to cosplay events together? Or whatever. But it's not like I'm going to force you or anything. I mean, only if you're okay with it. That's an easy request for me to honor. <laughs> really? Yes! But you seriously can't speak a word about my cosplay habits to the others, got it? If they found out, I'd never hear the end of it from them. It should be our ninja secret. <laughs> Keeping a secret with the CPU is a pretty cool feeling. Okay, so now that we're cosplay partners, let's make some great outfits together. Oh yeah, my ears are. Wait till I don't have to read this. My body is ready! Pick, pick, cling, cling. Pick, pick. Ah, it turns some dots in my brain! Can I stick at the contents from all the way in your ear? Oh no, it's cool, I can clean out in my own ears, but thank you very much. Already done. Ooh, that's boring. I'll deal with the TV event later.
If you want to progress in stories, etc. This method allows me to use this theory if I bypass this circuit, which then this. Hmm. Can I talk to you for a sec? Ugh. The last station one? What are you always doing all by yourself? Worlds. Dimensions. I saturate myself in researching how to transcend them. If I complete my research, I'm sure I can transcend worlds and dimensions both. If my experiments go well, warping between the worlds will be no mere fantasy. Indeed, all is from the chosen etchings upon the stone of destiny. Um, okay, that makes no sense, but it also sounds incredible. If there's something I can do to help, just say so. As the CPU of Last Station, I will lend my aid. I am grateful. In that case, dear assistant, could you fetch me that book over there? Right away! Wait! Who are you calling assistant? Oh, am I mistaken? You just swore to help me, so I thought that you were offering to be my helper. Well, logically, I guess, but I don't get it. But my gut reaction is to hate being called an assistant. Stop standing there blathering, assistant. The book. Now. I am not an assistant! Yes, understood. Now hurry up and get me that book, assistant. I said not to call me your assistant! Assist. I am not your assistant! <laughs> I was being facetious with you. You really should not take things so seriously. It's not that I took it seriously. I just have this weird aversion to being called someone's assistant. Circle. There's a reason I don't talk while doing this. Oh, so that seems up. Well, I still have some air left in my lungs. Even though I don't have to talk. The news! Some more the news. The other day in the Zika one of ruins. Neptune and the Noir. Well, my goodness gracious, these two miraculously became CPUs at the same time. I'm the main character, so duh, and it wasn't tough to do or anything. Nature is fun. There was a death in one of the parks in Planet City. 
and seen someone that was murdered. The victim was attacked with this. With, is this right? Um, with a hang glider? A pipe smoking detective is on the case. Those in the area, be careful out there. Be careful. That wraps up of the news. You're imagining things. Am I? Well, okay. We'll keep presenting the news in this fashion from now on, so flip that TV on every now and then. AKA once per chapter. Bye bye once again. Greetings, Scouts Potatoes! It's about to start the fun Happy Time Shopping program, Wallet Crusher Net. My plan is to purchase every item. You get a seemingly discount for all the items you purchase in Wallet Cross or Nap. It's a storm and a lovely guest and myself will recommend a spe at special price. With our exhilarating lineup, you'll be on the road to bankruptcy in no time fast. Flat. Without further ado, our first guest, Planetune CPU, Pluto. Let's shop till we drop. Ow, my neck. Since he settled in, let's roll on to our first product. Pow! Reflex. Which removes of the skill seal effect. Hit neck thing from Lean Box. Greetings, Neptune and Plutia. Um, hello. Recently, I was talking with uh, some friends who experienced poison and paralysis recently. We've never experienced any sort of seal of flexion before, so we don't know what it's like. How does it feel when I bend over my back eggs? Is it like that? Please tell me in greater detail. The end. Well, so the person gets poisoned regularly. That should be pretty uncommon for a normal person. Maybe he and his friends ate eat poison mushrooms. You can get paralyzed, paralyzed just from sitting with your legs tucked under your bum. So I get that. No, you can't. But your legs will get numb. So, um, skill seal, right? How do I put it? It's, a, it's a, like a real big mm, feeling, I guess. It's a, like everything turns into a chore and I feel like I've lost all my power. But I always feel that way. Mm. 
poets like feeling itsy, but not knowing where you're itsy at. Oh, getting warmer, even though you don't wanna use your skills, you don't know him anymore. Did I get all that take that name? That's it for your answer and all of Customer Corner. At a discounted price. Ten reflex for 980 money. Sounds good. The Millionaire Quiz. I'm thinking I will cheat the Millionaire Quiz in the future. But uh, the early ones are rather easy. If you've played the games and paid attention to the games. It's finally begun, Millionaire. Your presenters for today are the coolest girl ever, Neptune, and her lovely assistant, Plutia. Which is a quiz. This is a quiz show. Three quests in quiz each broadcast. You'll get a reward for correct answers. Nothing happens if you're wrong. Except for... And whoever... Gets all the answers correct through the very last episode will get one million credits. You really will become a millionaire. Which, quite frankly, there's an easy way to grind money before the end of the game. I think I may have four to five million credits in my test. Whoa, one million? But wait, Nappy. What's up? The final episode is way into the future. Will they still be happy about the prize? I won't. Let's start the quiz, go! Up the, the full Lowing. Which? Who is Neptune? My Neptune's little sister. Nap Gamer, Nap Beer, or Nap Gear? Nap Gear. Dingly doo! You get an item for correct answer. Question 2. Which item is required to become a CPU in this game industry? Sorisite? No. Key fragment? No. CPU memory? Yeah! Dingly <laughs> doo! Quest 
Neptune the third. What do I, Neptune, call her, Plutia? Bloopy. Pearl Rock. I'm not survivory. But it's too. Bloopy. Ding only do. Yeah! It does get harder over time. So I am here learning how to work from Noir. This must be a different place. Noir shouldn't care. What do you think it's normal? Come to the staff room later. I've never seen Histy so mad before. Oh, Blue Dear, doing no work and just napping. When you get back, I will not let you in the Basilica. Iris Heart appears, and for these longer ones, you can scroll with the left stick. HDD forms. Bathing for three. Any mood song? Not sure. But there are a lot of new cutscenes. And if you want to see that cutscene in full, it is called Let's scrub each other down. I can develop Meant, huh? Basically, it's a way to get better, better items than what's available in the shop. Game zero. It looks like an asin called the last asin was founded. I wonder how that will change the game industry. Noir went away and I'm sad. She lets me take so many pictures of her. Huh? Be careful not to get in an accident, you say. Do I? Oh, that's where Pura Pura comes from. Do I look? I've already read her. Huh? Is my work going well? It's fine. Thanks for worrying about it. The important thing is courage and love, and maybe a spirit of playfulness. Oh, uh, hello, I work at Plan Neptune's Basilica. I don't appear in the story, but I do work here, you know. Turning into a glycerin crystal now. Can I buy stuff? I'll buy Mr. Froggy and Silver Sword because, well, the MC be powerful. Don't really care about any of those. And, uh, we'll get all those events. 
easily. But at the moment, they're way too expensive. Parent fashion will be a very valuable one. And I'm not gonna be crazy and buy the blade. We will have at least one of these of those. Let's enter Plan Neptune and check in the guild. Accept all these quests. If we only had more Dogudel, we could make Nepal. The invisible cloth is an item that allows you to grind money. But you kinda can't get it yet. And uh, that's where I'm calling it this time. I don't think I'll be recording more today because I'm too tired to record. So remember to like, comment, and subscribe. But most of all, as always, keep it joyful! And I'm still wearing the ring, baby!